morning, faculty, staff, and students, and everybody who is joining in with us. Today is Monday, October 26th, and again, we're excited to have all of you joining in with us today. At this time, we ask everyone, if you would, please stand for our Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Let us pause at this time for a moment of silent reflection. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. We are so excited to get a new week started and kicking off a brand new week. Now, as a reminder, we have made some adjustments within our bail schedule. Most notably will be that we will begin fourth period at 1230. Yes, 1230 is when we will begin fourth period. Please make sure that you log in and are there on time as we again are, log, are beginning fourth period at 1230. Okay. We are also excited to have our uh, cohort A students who will be joining us on campus. That now includes grades 9 through 12. So we have grades 9 through 12 who will be with us on campus uh, for the cohort. Those are those students that have registered. Those are those students that have completed uh, the uh, very important registration information in order to participate in our face-to-face -face learning. Those students should arrive on campus no later than 7.30. We're hoping that you guys will get there by 7.30 so that you will have time to prepare and get ready for classes beginning at 8 a.m. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we want to say congratulations to our Lady Wolverines volleyball team who were victorious on Saturday as they defeated Lamar County High School. Congratulations, ladies, and they will be moving to the next round of the state volleyball tournament as they'll be playing Elite Scholars Academy. Now, we're awaiting game information. As soon as we have that, we will share that information with you. Also, this week will be our cross-country meet will be taking place in Jeff Davis County. Again, yes, Jeff Davis County this week, so our cross-country runners will be running in their region tournament this weekend. So we want to say congratulations to all of our Wolverines on a job well done, and we look forward to their continued success throughout their seasons. Well, ladies and gentlemen, did you know that today was National Pumpkin Day? Yes, today is National Pumpkin Day, and we are looking ahead to Halloween when all those pumpkins and everything are going to be out. But ladies and gentlemen, we ask that as you make your preparations for Halloween and trick-or-treating, that you do so in a safe manner. Please make sure that you wear a mask. No better time to wear a mask than on Halloween. And keep your social distance. Again, want to make sure that you guys are safe during these times. Our word of the day, yes, our word of the day is zhuzh. Zhuzh is our word of the day, meaning to make exciting or more lively. So ladies and gentlemen, hopefully you are making uh, your online or your virtual learning uh, an experience that is lively and exciting. And for those of you who will be joining us on campus, we hope that it is that for you as well. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this concludes our morning announcements. As always, I love you and let's have a great day today.